Hi, I'm James, and in this video I'm taking a look at how to free up some of that disk space which is in use after upgrading from Windows 7 or 8 to Windows 10. And what you have, basically, on the C drive you have this Windows folder which contains the Windows 10 installer, and Windows.old which has your uh, old operating system. As you can see, even on this machine, which was upgraded graded from a completely clean Windows 7 install, um, not even updated, uh, we're still losing to the installer and uh, the old OS 14.2 uh, gigabytes. So we want to gain that back and we don't want to have to wait for Windows to clear that up itself. So we're going to select the C drive and properties, disk cleanup, this is now going to look at the machine's drive, uh, analyze sort of for temporary files and things like that. You can use this normally to free up a bit of disk space uh, and get rid of temporary files, internet caches, things like that, uh, error logs and all sorts. So this will just take a moment to run through. So now you can see here it's gone through and it's found 12 megs of files but if we select this button down the bottom here which is clean up system files this will now elevate oh, in fact it hasn't elevated it's just going to go straight into it um already had admin rights uh, you have to be an admin user to do this you can't be a standard user um so if it was a standard user it would ask you to enter your password it doesn't need to otherwise so this is now going to look through some of the other things that it can clean up including system files so you can see here it's got windows update cleanup other things which it hadn't looked at before and now we've still only got 12 megs selected but we've got previous windows install at 14 gigs and temporary windows installation files at 600 megs so if we press the OK button, that will then go through and remove those. So we'd be freeing up 14 gigs of space. Um, when you think that with this installation, we're only actually using 47 gigs at this moment. So that's actually going to be cutting down a lot of that space that we've used up. And if you've got something with, say, a small SSD um, or a very limited space with, say, eMMC flash, then that's a really good way of getting that space back and giving more for you to use. I hope you found this video useful. Be sure to hit subscribe if you want to see more from us in the future and check out the rest of the content on our channel. Thanks for watching.